Hey everyone, what's up? I got an R-U-U-U-U match for you today against someone by the name of King Absol one Leave his link in the description below. Um, trying out this UU team, you know, just kind of wanted to, you know, throw stuff together and play a UU match, and, um, this is basically how it went. It was, a uh, it was a pretty good match, um, <clears throat> obviously not the best match, well, not obviously, but to me, not one of my best matches, but still good nonetheless, and let's just get started. So he's going to lead off with an out of Gazam, I'm going to lead off with a Hitmonlee. Um, I don't want to stay in, that's a very bad, bad, bad matchup for me. Um, so I just go out into my Dawn Pen to <clears throat> yeah, take something. I don't I don't know what he's going to go for, I really don't have anything that wants to take a hit from this thing. Um, even though going out into my uh, <clears throat> yeah, Dust Clops would have been a good idea, I don't. Um, now I know I'm going to die, so I just go for the Ice Shard because I'm going to be slower anyway. Just want to get some damage off, break the potential sash if he has it. Gonna do close to half, and um, now I just lose my Dawn Fan because I'm a dumbass. So now Dawn Fan is dead, and um, he takes that early 6 to 5 lead. And I'm just gonna go out into my Scarfed Flosion. Scarfed Flosion likes to do stuff and stuff. And um, I'm gonna hit something coming in with a in, 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 gonna hit something with an eruption. Good lord, I cannot speak. And uh, choose, he chooses to uh, just fodder out his cast form, and so um, goodbye cast form. That is the end of you. And yep, goodbye cast form. Um, yeah, well, there's nothing really, um, really big happening, but he goes out into Zlapras, and I'm thinking, no, don't want to take a water tech, nope, gonna go out into my Slowbro to take it, because Slowbro's a monster, and he turns out to be a curse, uh, curse Lapras, and I'm like, aw, oh, curse Lapras, and I don't know what to do here, I'm just like, I, I don't know, I, I think I just go for the Calm Mind here, as he switches out for whatever reason, I switches out, probably can't hit me with anything. Even though he does a body slam and everything. But, yeah, I go for the Calm Mind on the Switch, and he goes out into his Alakazam, and I'm thinking, I can take a Shadow Ball pretty well and hit it back with something, right? Right? You know, I can just set up another Calm Mind, because I am plus one, and nope, nope, that's going to do a lot. And, yeah, I should, no, yep. And he gets a Spadef Drop. So, and I go for the Calm Mind, because I'm stupid, I should have gone for the Surf. But I thought I could take that better, so, you know, that's what happened there. And now I have plus two special attack and plus one special defense, so I don't want to stay in there at all. So, of course, I'm going to switch out going to my Dusclops now to take a Shadow Ball. Um, <clears throat> and uh, judging from this damage, it's going to do, or it goes for the Energy Ball. My bad. Not the Shadow Ball, it's the Energy Ball. Um... I'm gonna do about the fourth ish. Um, gonna hit me with a shadow ball now, and, and then, yeah, it kills me with the critical hit, which may or may not have mattered. I'm gonna say may did it. It did matter. The dust clouds can take that. But anywho, gonna go out into the only thing I have to outspeed this Alakazam, which is my uh, what's his face, uh, the, the, the Jolteon, and he goes out into his Obama Snow. This is a hail team, and it sucks, and I hate it. And I go for the Shadow Ball, predicting to switch out, or, you know, just to hit anything. I don't know, just kind of went to hit something. It does about a fourth. And, um, now I'm just going to go ahead and go for the Protect and scout out what he wants to do. See if he's going to switch out, or I don't know. But it goes for the Earthquake, which means I can go into something to take the Earthquake. And in this case, I choose... Ah, my, my defensive slow bro, max defense. This isn't going to do anything to it. Just look at this. 281, 281 HPs. It's going to do, it's going to do 120. It's going to do about 120. And, you know, slow bro taking that. Not as well as I thought at the first glance. But he knows he can't take me out with another earthquake. So he goes out into his Alakazam. And I go for the surf, predicting him to switch out and... You know, I'm like, oh, Alakazam, that thing, that thing can't take a hit. I'm a slow bro, I have special attack, and nope, going to live. Yup, he's going to live. 
that just really sucks, and I hate it, really, I really do. But, um, so he lives with that smidgen of smidgen ever, I hate it, can't kill anything with that. Now I'll just go out into my Hitmonlee to fodder it out, basically. And, um, yeah, he's gonna hit me with the Shadow Ball, gonna get a crit. It may have mattered, may not have mattered, I don't know. It might have, may not have, I don't know. Probably gonna say that it did it in the long run. Yeah, it didn't in the long run, but, you know. But anyway, it's gonna go into my, uh, thing now. Jolteon, gonna kill it with the Thunderbolt. So that thing's dead, finally. It was just annoying. That was just annoying. But now he goes back out into his bomb snow to take another hit and go for an attacking move, and he protects myself for scouting, and I'm like, Seed Bomb, I can, I can take a Seed Bomb, no problem, I, I can take that, I can go for a Thunderbolt and take that and kill it with another Thunderbolt, and this is all gonna be good, but, but I can't because he's choice banded and stabbed and probably max attack and probably adamant and this is crap, and that was just stupid on my part. But, um, now I just go out into my Flosion, because Flosion is scarfed and he kills things. Because that's what Flosions do, they kill things. And, um, Flosion's going, to, he's going to go out into his Crygonal. Cry, Crygonal now. I'm going to go for the Eruption, because, you know, I'm at full health, it's going to hit something with an Eruption that's going to hurt. He goes out into this thing, I'm like, heck yeah! Kick this thing's ass, and it's, psh, can't do shit, and then it lives the smidgenest smidgen ever. Typhlosion, why can't you kill anything? Are you that useless that you can't kill anything? I am disappointed in you, Typhlosion. So now I'm just gonna go for another eruption because I don't want I don't like this thing. It's annoying and I don't like Cragonals and Typhlosion didn't kill it last time. And, uh, stupid type Cragonal. Stupid Typhlosion can't kill anything. The Antiflosion, not on speaking terms right now, because it just it doesn't kill things. It just kill things, Typhlosion. So, Lapras comes in, I'm like, you know what? Fuck you, Lapras. I'm going for another eruption, just because I know you'll probably set up a curse predicting me to switch out. And that, that doesn't do quite half. Maybe at full health, I could have done over half, and that would have been a two-hit KO. But, but it's not. It's not. So, yeah. It's not really going to help me with anything, because that Lapras is just getting HPs back, and I'm not. <sighs> ah, excuse me. But, now I'm just like, ah, I can't do anything. I'm just going to switch out into my Merp. And he goes for the Waterfall, predicting me, you're just trying to get some damage off on me. But Merp is going to take that really well, and Merp is just going to stay in the green, and force this thing out, I think I go for the Psychic here, honestly. You know, I go for either Psychic or Calm Mind, and I don't remember which one it is. I know he just switches out and everything, and go out into his, uh, Raikou now. Um, yeah, I do, I remember. I go for the Psychic predicting the switch, because it's what I do, I predict the switch, and Surf would have done a lot more, and, and yeah, and so that does about a third. And, yeah, about a third, and, oh man, I'm just tired, tired, tired. Anyways, this is about a third, and I'm thinking, you know, I'm a slow bro, I can, I can take a Thunderbolt from a Raikou. I can, I can just take a Thunderbolt, I know I can, I'm a Ra I'm a, I'm a slow bro, man. And, and I don't take it at all, I die, and that's really bad, and I, and I don't like that, and, so now this Raikou just killed my Merp, and now I think I only have one thing left. Yeah, I have one thing left. I have this Typhlosion left, and he has like 50,000 things, or three, whichever. And I'm like, I don't have enough HPs for to for to Eruption, so I'm just going to go for to Fire Blast and kill it. And nope, nope, I don't kill it because, because Typhlosion just doesn't kill things anymore. It's just like... It's just like, hey, Typhlosion, hey, go kill this thing, and Typhlosion's like, nope, I don't, I don't feel like it, I'm not going to, and so he doesn't kill things, and he leaves them with, like, the smidgenest smidgen ever, and 
it's just really annoying. And now this thing comes out, and this thing's choice banded, and it has ice shard, and that's going to do a lot, even though I resist. It does like 50, and I'm just gonna fire blast it and kill it. And I'm thinking maybe I can mount a comeback here, like, like I, c I can do this. I mean, you know, I have, and all that's left is a Lapras, and I can t kill that Lapras, hopefully. If Typhlosion doesn't feel like, you know, not killing things all of a sudden again. Because Typhlosion just doesn't kill things a lot. Or when I need him to. And, he, and this Lapras has Ice Shard too, and that really sucks. Because I this thing shouldn't have had Ice Shard, and I should have been able to come back. But I couldn't, and I lose 1-0 to zero after that miniature comeback with Typhlosion that can't kill anything. And, um, this, this, this puts me in Typhlosion on not speaking terms, and, yeah, because I mean, you can't kill things, just kill things, that's all I'm asking you to do, Typhlosion, but, <sighs> anyways, um, if you like the video, leave a like down below, if you dislike, leave a dislike, and, um, go ahead, leave a comment, if you feel so compelled to do so, feel so compelled to do so. That, that's a lot of words. And um, if you like this video, go ahead check out my channel for more. If you like my content, leave a sub. It's always nice to uh, see new faces around. And um, yep, I think that's really all I have to say. Thank you for watching. Have a great day, everyone.